Are you having one of those days? When you can't figure where to find love or whether the love you have is really love? When you can't seem to find your own place in this vast universe? When you don't have control over everything that's happening to you and nothing goes your way? When you realize you are not who you wanted to be? The Girl Oracle deck is here to serve as your guide. Each card will guide your spirits towards the answers you are looking for, or path you are meant to walk, or truths you have to realize and live. Whether it's love, relationships, dreams, enemies, or other struggles you face as you journey to your destiny, let the Girl Deck by Sal be your guide. Come and join me at my first meetup in Los Angeles and let's explore the girl deck together. Hi Aquarian, welcome to my channel. <laughs> What's the excitement, Sal? Um, I think it's the second time I'm showing my excitement, guys. Well, one, I just came from a very wonderful, wonderful uh, vacation. It's called getting some sleep. Okay. <laughs> That's what I got. <laughs> and I'm very thankful. That's why someone is energized over here. And also, what keeps me energized every day? And they always ask me, how do you stay positive, Sal? I tell them the girl deck. <laughs> it's a must-have. I mean, if you are a person who is learning to read oracle cards, it's the best. It's the best. Is the best. I'm kidding. <laughs> no, <laughs> this is my very first. I'm kidding. It's about a preference. It's your intuition that will guide you. Whoever connects with it, okay? But it is out now at your latest, latest pharmacy. I'm kidding. I'm just getting all jokes right now here. <laughs> but you know the tea. We'll get the Oracle deck, okay? This is for 28 to the 29 for my aquarium. Here we go. Aquas. What happened? Should we start? It's the first card, okay. but they say also it's a strong card. <laughs> I was happy, Aqua. Why you have a three of swords? <laughs> I'm an Aquarian too. Okay. What up with that? Dímelo. ¿Qué? ¿Por qué? <laughs> My golly. Okay, three of swords. We all know what it is. Someone is in pain. Someone is heartache. Let's see, okay. Someone is just about gaining weight. Spanks, whatever. Like, okay, today's a bad day, style. I'm feeling bloated and I don't feel good. Three of swords. I'm hurting. Okay. Okay. We'll see. Oh, wait, gaining weight and I'm an aqua. <laughs> Here we go. Three of swords. Let's see what the other person is. What's the other person? We'll see. Nine of cups. Someone is wishing that you be okay. Or someone you're connecting with is not okay. And you're telling them, I wish it'll be okay. Uh, you're wishing something good for a person that is not, let me see. But you're not telling them even. So it's like this. I wish, you know, like, I wish that they're going to be fine. Because you kind of know, you kind of connect with them. So it's not about this person lying, cheating on you. You just know something is up, something is wrong. And you're wishing. Because Nine of Cups is looking at behind, at the back of them, is Three of Swords. But this can be someone doing this to you. I wish it'd be fine. They're worried, you know, like, or you're worried for someone. This is about you having concern. Either you work for urgent care, you know, like that, like that kind of concern, you know. It's like some sort of emergency that you're looking at, that you need this per you need to give this person some sort of guidance. Because um, Nine of Cups is K2, and it's very spiritual. So you could be talking to this person about some sort of, like, spiritual enlightenment. Okay. Let me see one second over here. Next to the Three of Swords, let me see here, the Sun card, and they got the message. <laughs> so out of sadness, here comes happiness. That's good. So this person was hurting, and then you tell them, it's like, you'll be fine, you'll be good. Oh, you put emotional... Uh, but soulful help with the sun card. The sun is in uh, Capricorn. If you connect with a Capricorn, girl, you need to watch it. Okay. With the sun and three of swords over here, someone here has healed from their past or whatever agony that they're go going through. Okay. Someone is just not happy with the way they look. Aesthetics, I feel here. Because they're covering their face. And it's like, I have better days. I have a pimple. I have a breakout. I don't look at me, you know. That's that's hurtful. <laughs> Sometimes it's not about cheating every time. Okay. 
But this is also someone realizing that someone cheated on them. Like you're connected with someone, they got cheated on. Capish? Oh. Let me see here. It can be a Leo, Sun and Capricorn. Magician. Okay, so you're doing everything. It's also someone who's doing the craft. Okay. To make their wish come true with the Nine of Cups, I will do some sort of moon magic manifestation. Let me do some sort of an Ace of Cups, pour some water, a little bit of a one magic over here, getting it from my website at e3love.me, which also comes in Moldavite. Okay. And then you have it all layered down from feelings, you know, as above, so below. I'm going to make this person feel good. What are you doing, Aqua? Because <laughs> that's K2 right there. You could be a spiritual teacher. Because all, all K2 for me is nines, okay? So that one. So K2 in a water sign energy here. K2 Scorpio, K2 Sag, uh, K2, oh, K2 Sag, K2 Scorpio, K2 um, Pisces, K2 Cancer. Someone here is a spiritual teacher who talks to the source itself. Magician with a sun card, they can connect with their soul and that's why this person can help the other person. This is someone that's a helper, okay? Like they help people, okay? Under the sun card with the three of swords. 10 of swords, oh wow! Oh, no, it's not 10, it's nine. <laughs> so someone is very warped. So someone here is about always thinking about pain and not, oh, a downer, but not Debbie. This is a worry on top of worry, okay, on top of worry. Someone is always worried, Aqua. And I feel like it's not you. Because you don't give an F. I don't think so. I mean, just like, okay. I mean, in, in essence, with right now you're fine. The one that you're kind of is not. That's why you're trying to stay optimistic about for them. Okay. Let me see the other person. Ace of Wands. Oh, so you did use a wand. Like what I told you. <laughs> what I told you. You did use a wand. Ah. Mm. Now. What is the one? If you didn't get it from my website, okay? Shame on you. Ace of Wands is about showing chemistry, okay? So you flirted. You messaged them. You tried to make them feel good by trying to make their, I don't know, man ego, girl ego at ease. Um, you tried to comfort them. It's like about some sort of attraction. This is about you telling them, it's like, you know what? If I show and I tell them that I'm attracted to them, they're going to feel good. Like it will boost their ego. Because you, they're down right now. Whoever you're connecting with, you know they're not in the upswing of their life. And you are the source of upswing. At the same time, the girl oracle deck is the source of upswing. Here we go. Let's see what is the girl oracle deck is saying. Let's see what the guide says here. Mm -hmm. Let me see here. Let's see. You were very creative. By the way, Ace of Wands is creative. You created something to give this to this person. You're very creative about it. Whatever you did was very creative, very artsy. Very, I don't know what's creative that you did, but they're worried. That's why. Okay, let me see. Girl, oh, creative! Look at that one. It's about someone sewing some some needles. You know, like fashion. Okay, very creative. Oh, let's see here. Learn by experience, not by mistake. Okay, you see that one. Learn by experience, not by mistake. So a lot of people will say, "Well, you learn if you make a mistake." How about? Here's why I come up with this. When you put mistake as the label, because you know, when we label something, it draws energy. A mistake draws energy and is not the good energy. Mistake will make you feel that you are someone who is wronged. Okay? I was wrong. And nobody is wrong in spirituality because you are where you're supposed to be. So how can you be wrong? Good or bad, you're where you're supposed to be. So you're never wrong. Nothing is a mistake. Everything is in a perfect time, perfect alignment. You understand me? The universe doesn't roll around every day because they just feel like it. Mm -mm. When they say the sun will rise, the sun will rise. So how is it when you get a burger and then you want it spaghetti? Those are all things already that have been decided. That's it. You're probably having lunch. Okay. <laughs> so when you already okay, um, understand that there is no mistake, everything right now is an experience. And once you learn by experience, soul growth is here. And at the same time, the girl card is always here. <laughs> Soul growth is here. That's the sun card. So this person always feel they're making a mistake in their life. And for you, chill. I'll show you. This is just something that you have to go through. You'll be fine. You're a good support to this person. You'll be fine. You always say this to this person. It's going to be okay. You're, lear you're teaching someone here to learn by experience. It's very amazing, this deck, I swear. <laughs> Look at that one. Learn, okay. 
My camera is not amazing, okay? My deck is, okay? <laughs> Learn by experience, okay? Not by mistake. Do not attract, okay? So stop with that. With about the mistake. People learn by their mistake. Nah, -uh. that's an old saying that needs to be rectified by one and only right here. Okay. <laughs> okay. So start spreading the news. Start spreading the news. Nobody learns by mistake because there is no mistake. Everything happens for a reason. And it's called an experience. Thank you very much, guys, for watching. The Girl Oracle deck is available in QVC on two payments. Okay. It comes in a gold edition, a diamond edition, which is. Um, one is limited, okay? So you pick your whatever you want. And then I'm going to continue this reading as you have become an emotional support, a spiritual support, a loving support, a creative support to this person. You probably work for some sort of support, a contact support, okay? <laughs> From e Love, okay? But you probably have some call center experience, you know, like those kind of people who calls. Um, you could be a receptionist person in the desk, in the clinic also I'm seeing here. Um, you could be a counselor or a healer. You have a lot of profession that I'm seeing here that you are trying to use to this person or give to this person. Amazeballs. Keep it up. I like it. Okay. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. This is the 28th to the 29th for the Aquas. I'll see you again. Okay. Bye, guys.